everyone. This is a wonderful day for me. It's December 9th, and we have a wonderful opening with Janet Powers and Peggy Everett, two of my favorite artists and longtime friends. And Peggy, I'd like to ask you and Janet how, first I'll start with Peggy and find out how we started. The show came together with the two of you. You both like to paint together? We, well, we don't actually get to paint together that much, but we like to be together. Yes. And Janet's very funny. Oh, she and is. she's a great artist, so I figure if I screw up, she'll fix it. Oh, I think that's wonderful. Just don't screw up. Oh, okay. And I can't wait to see Janet's to. funny sense of humor. Okay. <laughs> I love it. I haven't seen it either. Okay, well, that's all right. Janet, tell us how you feel about painting together with Peggy. I mean, I know y'all like one another and are yeah, friends. Yeah, well, we've painted together a couple of times, plain air, and uh, Peggy was gracious enough to invite me to have this exhibit with her. So that's how all of this got started. Well, I'm just so glad. I'm just excited to have an exhibit with Janet. Oh, yeah. Right. yeah. And I'm excited to have both of you <laughs> timid little people here, yes. okay? <laughs> one of us is timid. Uh, one. Good. Well, anyhow, thank you, Janet. We're going to come over in a little bit and look at okay. all of your work. And right. uh, Peggy, let's look at your okay. things now. Tell me what you painted, especially for this show. Um, a little bit of this is where I was this summer. I was in Colorado fly fishing, and this man actually stood there and cast several times for me. He said, lady, I came to fish. But this is uh, the Arkansas River in Salada, Colorado. This is, from my mind, it's a studio piece. You can see that it's a little different than when I do plein air. Uh, this is a plein air piece in Arizona that actually won some awards. This one, um, I just made it up because I saw this cloud one day and I photographed it and then I like, I like to put it in different versions in paintings. And then I spend a lot of time on Cumberland. This is a um, little horse on Cumberland. And over here is my favorite subject, the bagpiper, because they sell. <laughs> <laughs> Naturally. Naturally. And normally I do little ones. And so it's kind of a shock to see a big bagpiper here. And this one actually is three of my dogs and two of my friend's dogs. But, and I kind of tried to do it like an old English dog painting. Peggy, there was a collector in today that was so fascinated. You talked with him. And yeah. uh, what all did he say? He, was, uh, he said, oh, this reminds me of the old English paintings. And I said, well, you got it. That's just what I Good. tried to do. But, except that I know these dogs, actually personally. And um, up here I was going down the Altamaha in a canoe and photographed this and then I made up the buck because nobody has racked that big. Well this is a great occasion with you and Janet in here and thank you so well, much for this excited. little preview of your work. And now we're going to walk over and talk about Janet's paintings. I've known Janet for a long time also and uh, she's a friend of my brother's. Yes. Actually. Yes. John Huey who collects some of her work. Yes. So tell us, uh, I'm interested, intrigued with this first one, uh, Janet, here. How many paintings are on that? It's 16. 16. It's small, on this, eight by 10. All of these. And it's called a montage, which means a collection of smaller works to make one work. Um, so I had done one, uh, one of very muted colors, and it's on the, actually on the cover of my coffee table book. And then I decided to do one with bright colors and sunsets. Uh, the more I live here, we live on the Little Satilla River, the more I'm into painting skies because that's really? what's in here. We look at the sky, sunset every day. and uh, So I guess most of these, not all of them, but many of them are about skies, the sunset. And you and live, you're, you and your husband have a place right on the Little Satilla? On the river. This, uh -huh. this painting here is looking uh, from our dock. I see. That's the West View. And uh, most of my paintings are this is also, uh, and this is right down the Little Satilla River from us. That's an unusual happening in this area, the palms. That's um, a little different than, than a lot of your work. Yes. And you paint strictly with oil on canvas. Yes. That's your main thing. And you yes. love teaching, I understand. Well, I, I do. I uh -huh. enjoy it. I don't think I'm a very good teacher. I'm not very articulate. You are too. <laughs> Thank you. But, uh, yeah, I enjoy So teaching it. is a part of your life, to share yes. some of this. Yes, yes. Well, I just think it's wonderful. The three of us have gotten together. I'm Millie Wilcox, and I'm the director of the Left Bank Art Gallery. And uh, Janet has a gallery in Brunswick, Brunswick called Gallery on Newcastle. Right. 
and uh, Peggy has her own studio in her home and then you can contact them here also but this is the first of these little videos that we're going to do showing our artists at work. Now we're going to have artists in action tonight About in about an hour. I think they will complete a painting together. We hope. <laughs> we hope, okay. Yeah.